Hi, my name is Lisa Jackson, and I'm Vice President of Environment Policy and Social Initiatives at Apple. At Apple, we think making the best, most innovative technology means taking responsibility for how we make it in a way that's good for the planet we all share. That means taking responsibility for the carbon emissions from our company and our entire supply chain. Nearly half of our comprehensive carbon footprint comes from electricity used to manufacture our products. We launched our supplier clean energy program in 2015 to help our suppliers reduce their energy use by improving energy efficiency and to support their transition to 100% renewable energy for their Apple production. And we're deeply proud of the progress they've made. As of June 2020, 71 manufacturing partners in 17 different countries have committed to 100% renewable electricity. This will yield nearly 8 gigawatts of clean energy to power the manufacturing of our products. Once completed, their efforts will avoid the equivalent of taking more than 3 million cars off the road each year. We recently set a new ambitious goal to transition our entire manufacturing supply chain to 100% renewable electricity by 2030. And we are committed to supporting our suppliers at every step of their journey. Our Supplier Clean Energy Portal offers training and tools for suppliers switching to clean energy. And last year, Apple hosted its first ever in-person training for over 30 suppliers in China. We created the $300 million China Clean Energy Fund which enables Apple and our suppliers to invest in projects producing more than one gigawatt of renewable energy. In countries where Apple and our suppliers operate, we're advocating for policies to grow the development of cost-effective renewable energy. Our hope is that by working with suppliers to find viable solutions to powering their facilities with renewable energy, we can help demonstrate that investing in green technology is just good business. Thank you.